Hello, y'all. Hello. Good evening. Y'all, come on in. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. <clears throat> I don't see no comments yet, but I see it. Okay, BB. BB Pearson. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Deborah McCray, Linda. Good afternoon. I am good, Linda. Good afternoon, Teresa. Good afternoon, Brenda. I love you too, Brenda. Good afternoon, Mary. Good afternoon, Sheila. Hey, Jan, how are you? Well, Jan, I've been doing a lot of videos, uh, so you haven't really been missing me. I ain't been going live. Good afternoon, Cynthia. Beverly, Melissa, hey Betty, how you doing? Good afternoon, Crystal, Vanessa, uh, Janie. Well, Linda, I haven't been going live much lately. I've been busy. Good afternoon, Vera. So I've been just posting videos, uh, and I'm fixing to, uh, I came on here to show y'all my pig feet and beans. I'm going to make some cornbread right quick. Uh, and I'm going to do a dessert for y'all. So I'm putting my skillet in the oven to melt my butter and my shortening. Because y'all know I mix my uh, butter and shortening. Hey, Carla. Good afternoon, uh, Lisa Collins. Hey, Natalie, how you doing? Good afternoon, Roxy, Carolyn. Well, I hope everyone is uh, doing uh, absolutely amazing. Uh, this is the first sunshiny day we've had in a long time. In about two weeks, uh, we actually got some sun today, so I'm thankful for that. And so... Uh, Hey, Vanessa. Hello, Robin. So, uh, hey, Ella. So, yeah, we got sunshine. It's a beautiful day. Not too hot yet. So, uh, and guys, Byron going back to work today. Praise the Lord. God is so good. Uh, we didn't think this was going to be possible. The doctor cleared him, said he's fine. Uh, to go back to work. Uh, so he's going back to work today. Praise God. So <clears throat> I'm going to fix this cornbread right quick. So I don't know what he's going to take for his lunch, but I'm going to fix this. So let's get started. So today I'm making a little bit uh, more cornbread than I usually make. Uh, I'm not using my small skillet. I'm using one a little bit larger. So today I got one and a half cups of self-rising meal. I have three-fourths cups of self-rising flour. Okay. And I'm going to put some sugar in my cornbread because we like our cornbread sweet. Good afternoon, Brian. Andreas. Hey, Troy, good afternoon. So let me put some sugar down. Let me see what made this is a tablespoon, so I'm putting three tablespoons down. Now you can leave the sugar out. We like sweet cornbread. Okay. How is everybody doing? Good afternoon, Carolyn from Houston, Texas. Y'all, I thank y'all for joining me. Oh, I can, got sugar all over here. I thank y'all for joining me this afternoon. And y'all do an old lady a favor. Share the love. Share the love, guys. So, now I'm going to put one egg. Well, since I'm making more, I think I'm going to put two eggs down in here. Because this is more than I usually make. 
I just thought about that. Now, and, uh, I don't have buttermilk today, and I wasn't fixing to go to the store to buy any, so I'm using a uh, sweet milk, a whole milk. And it's going to do just fine. Good afternoon, Jennifer. Hey, Debbie Bradshaw, girl, how you doing? think that's going to be enough. Thank you, Robin. Thank you. Hey, TJ Etheridge. How are you doing? Good afternoon. Yeah, I'll tell you. Let me check this. Now, I just pour my melted oil right over in there like that. Stir it up real good. Put it back in my pan. And put it back in my 400 degree oven. Ugh. Make sure I get all my stuff out. My little, uh, my little skillet gotten, has gotten too little for us. That's just, uh, one meal, my little skillet now, since my sister here. And, uh. Yeah. So, that'll cook. About 10 or 12 minutes. Maybe a little bit longer. Let me put this back and then I'm going to let y'all see uh, these beans and pig feet and tails. Okay. <laughs> Let y'all see. Let the uh, steam settle. Let me get y'all a good angle. Trying to get you a good angle. That's it. Y'all see that? Y'all, and they smell so good. Oh, they smell wonderful. Uh, I cannot wait. Okay. Now let me let y'all see these pig feet and pig tails. Y'all, look at that. Look at that. And they so tender, y'all. Y'all see them? And I'm all. Oh, yes, Tama. It smells delicious. It smells delicious in here. I had to, uh, go outside. I had to run to the store. And I smelt it in the driveway when I got out of the car. I said, oh, my God, 
I'm going in there and make cornbread right away. Hey, Johnny. Thank you, Johnny. Hey, Adrian, Angela, y'all, and welcome all y'all newbies to the channel. I see some names on here uh, that I'm, I've not seen before. Oh, okay, Tama. I'll be looking for it. I'll be looking for it. Oh, well, Carolyn, you know I got the hot sauce on board. Hey, Big Mo. So, y'all, let me keep going. Now, this is a quick and easy dessert I'm fixing to make. Quick and easy and delicious. Okay. And very few ingredients. I got me some strawberries draining that I washed and got them drained. Now, I'm going to cut... Uh, Cut some of them up. This is going to be a real quick and easy. You know, it's a it's a good summer dessert, too. Some of y'all might already know about this dessert. Yeah. Wait a minute. I'm going to wash this glass bowl because I want to make it in here. So... Yeah, just give me a minute. Sorry, guys. But I want to make it in here so y'all can really see it good. That's why I want to make it in this glass bowl so y'all can really see it. Good afternoon, Mary. Thank you for the stars. Oh, I don't know who sent her. Thank you for the stars, Robin. I'll, I'm going to make it in this bowl because I want y'all to see it. Okay. Now. First thing I'm going to do is get these some of these strawberries. Move that out of y'all way. Strawberries cut up. Ain't these some big, nice strawberries? I'm going to get some of them cut up. Get another bowl to put them in. Because I don't need that many starting off. I just need a few. And I'm going to cut them up fine. I mean, you know, small. Because this is going into the actual pie. And I guess I should have did this before I got on here. But it won't take me long. Y'all going to love this dessert because it's so simple. What, four ingredients? And you don't make this a pie? You don't make no crust. You buy your pie crust. I'm using, and it had, it's a graham cracker crust. Now, you could make your own crust, but I'm not doing that today. I'm going to use this store-bought crust I got. Oh, Sharon, me too. I love strawberries too. Last night, uh, I went way back. Look at this, y'all. I went way back on the strawberries. I remember my, how my mama used to uh, do them. Because my mama would just put uh, cream over them. Well, What we call cream, but it was actually evaporated milk. You know, milk in the can. My mama would uh, take strawberries, cut them up, put some of that canned milk on them, and just a little sugar. You, you tell my son was good. Oh, man, that was so good. It really was good. I think this 
you right here gonna be enough for what I want to do with them. Good afternoon, Juanita. How are you? Good afternoon, Vicky. Good afternoon, Deborah Gilmore. I think this is gonna be enough for what I want to do. Now, uh, to the same recipe here that I'm doing, you could add cream cheese to it. And uh, have your strawberry cheesecake. No bake. Pure wood. Okay. Oh, let me get me a few more that I need. Some little ones. I'm just going to cut in half. And I'm going to leave a little green part on these just for decorations. Oh, they smell so good. I want the smile. I want the real big ones because I'm going to eat those. Maybe one more. see if that's going to be enough. So I'm going to sit that to the side. So let's get started with this easy. I mean super easy. I'm going to open my graham cracker. Store bought graham cracker crust. And I'm making it. See, we have us a dessert this evening because this pie needs to chill at least, at least two hours. At least. You can do it overnight. It's even better if uh, you do it and mm -mm. got that left. Let me get this. I ain't off the top of here because this is going to go back down over. Yeah, if you do it overnight, it's even better. Let me get my foot top here. Good afternoon, Dorothy. Good afternoon. Brenda Jordan, Lakeisha, good afternoon, Johnny Johnson, yes, Johnny, well, if you like easy, this is a recipe for you, if you like easy, this is one, okay, mm -mm. Let me get me a spatula. Okay, y'all ready? Let's go then. And it's no order you you do this in. You do it like you wanna. And I'm gonna start. I'm gonna use this whole cup of whipped topping. Get all of it out. Uh, okay. Now. Next thing, you got two pack. Well, I'm using. I might not use all two, but. You need you some strawberry Kool-Aid. Good afternoon, Denise. Hey, Linda. How are you? Hey, Diane. Need you some strawberry Kool-Aid. Now, I'm going to put one whole package down in there. And I'm going to wait to see if that's going to be enough. 
And now I'm going to put a whole can of sweetened condensed milk. I mean, y'all, this is real easy and real good. Real good and real easy. Getting all that out. And you're going to just gently fold it over till you get everything all mixed up. Oh, it smells so good, y'all. Smells so good. Good afternoon, Barry. Yes, they are. So now what I'm going to do them strawberries I cut up or diced up. Hey, Deborah Clay, I'm going to put those down in there. Smells so good. Okay. We're going to gently fold those in. You want to get everything mixed up really well. Hey, Barbara Washington. Hey, Vanessa Hollis. Hey, Diane Walker. This is the easiest pie you'll ever make. And I'm just gently folding it to make sure everything is mixed up well. And go to the bottom because you know that Kool-Aid will get down there and stick on the bottom. Go to the bottom when you're stirring to make sure you fold it over good. And your condensed milk and everything is mixed together well. And see, you have to get to the bottom because just that stir, I saw some milk down there that wasn't mi mixed. When you fold them, you got to make sure you dig deep. Can y'all see that? Make sure your milk and your whipped topping and the Kool-Aid is mixed good. Till it's creamy and smooth. That's what you want. You want smooth filling. And once it's mixed well, once that uh, sweetened condensed milk and this topping is mixed well, it will be smooth. And that's mixed well. Y'all see how it's looking? Hello, Joyce Marshall. Will you be making the pie on Sunday? I make desserts on Sunday to go with my soul food dinners. Uh, no, I'm making this today, and we're going to eat this today, this evening. Okay, get your crust. And you just put your filling right down in your crust.
Okay, and spread it. Oh, I try not to hit the sides, guys. Like, I just hit one of my sides. Mm. It'll be all right, though. Just trying to push it to the end, even it out, all around. That's it. Mm. Mm. I'm telling you, it tastes like strawberry ice cream. Trying to decide. I'm going to put them all around. Cut a few more I need uh, to make it go all the way round, but I ain't got nothing but these big ones left. Here's a kind of small one. Perfect. Now I'm going to cut this uh, later on and I'm going to post a picture of it. That's to be it. It's too big. Oh, snap. This one might work. Now I'm going to let y'all see. Don't that look delicious? And you think that ain't gonna be delicious this afternoon? Once it's cold. Y'all, I'm gonna lick this bowl. That's good. That's real good. So now... I'm going to put this in the refrigerator. And, uh, we're going to have this this evening. Cornbread ready, guys. Gotta get me some butter on it right quick. And then I'll let y'all see it.
me let y'all see it. Come on. That's the cornbread, guys. That's the cornbread, guys. So now, y'all know what I'm having for dinner and dessert. Hey, Vivian, how are you? Hey, Deanna. Yes, Linda. So I'm going to clean up my mess here. For about the third time today. But that's all right. So I thank y'all for watching. Yes, Barry, I don't do Jiffy and I don't have anything against uh, Jiffy because Byron used to love Jiffy. Hey, Mary Talbert from Alabama. What part of Alabama, Mary? Byron used to love Jiffy. Uh, yeah, Epps, I did show my food. And uh, when we first met and I first cooked uh, for him, I knew he liked cornbread. And he used to love Jiffy. But, honey, I made him some harm, some homemade cornbread with meal and flour, eggs, milk, and sugar. He ain't wanted no more Jiffy. Oh, I'm sorry. You are exactly right, Deborah. Dishes and laundry never end. Oh, I'm sorry your screen green, Vanessa. Hey, Doris. I, I did, Vivian. I had a great Father's Day and Juneteenth. I did. You know, here in Alabama, we celebrate Juneteenth. Uh, and in Birmingham, we had celebrations going on all last week for Juneteenth. And uh, the last one was yesterday. So we celebrated the whole week uh, for Juneteenth. Oh, okay, good, Carla. Well, guys, I thank y'all for joining me. I thank y'all so very, very much for joining me this evening. I thank you for the stars. Uh, I thank you for sharing. Sharing is caring. Oh, you in Mobile, Mary? Okay, home, girl. So, um... I just thank you. I love y'all. I hope you all have the most amazing rest of your day. And I don't know. I might come back just this evening and get us a topic we can discuss. And we'll have us some porch talk. Y'all want to have porch talk? Give me some hearts and thumbs. Yes, ma'am, Nate. Dean ain't nothing like... uh. Cornbread made in a cast iron skillet. Okay, y'all wanna have want me to come back this evening for porch talk? I get us a topic and we can discuss it. Uh Debbie, I I let me see what kind I got now. I got Martha White uh self rising yellow cornmeal mix right now, Debbie. But uh, I get whatever is on sale, self-rising meal. Whatever is on sale. Hey, C, you want me to come back? Linda, okay. Well, guys, I'm going to get us a topic to talk about, or I might just come, and, come on and ask y'all what y'all want to talk about. But uh, I'll be back later on this evening. Camita, you want to talk? Okay, then. Miss Cole, you want to talk? Okay. Well, I'm going to be back where I have time to just sit down and talk and answer all y'all questions. And uh, I'm going to get a, uh, 
a topic for us to discuss. So I thank y'all. Y'all go on and enjoy the rest of your evening. And uh, I thank you for joining me so very much. Uh, some of you come day after day. Some of you, uh, I feel you like your family because I've been seeing your names for so long. So I love y'all. I thank y'all. And until I see you again, love, peace, and blessings. Bye-bye, guys.